Well, a city built on seven hills, Kampala, the capital of Uganda, offers an exciting cultural experience for many foreigners. Rated by the UN as the country with the happiest people in East Africa, many expatriates find it easy to stay and live comfortably within the city. Michael Balik traveled to Kampala to find out what residents think of the rapidly growing area. The hustle and bustle welcomes you to Kampala. The roads and streets are jammed with cars and people from all walks of life. For many foreigners commonly known as Muzungu, it's no easy task to find their way around. Kampala, at first it is so crazy. For uh, Muzungu, it's a little bit hard to find things that you need. The city itself is not easy to access at times because of the traffic jam. The modern supermarkets and shopping malls found in the central business district are a reflection of a fast-growing economy. But the old open markets with fresh organic foods and fruits are an experience for many expatriates. I went to the market. This was my favorite because the prices were so good. Uh, and it's also nice to talk to the people selling the, the food. Food is a big part of life in Uganda and many restaurants here serve local dishes which are now getting popular with foreigners. My favorite is posho and beans. Things like sweet potatoes, yams, the food is in plenty. I love the food here. Uganda is growing rapidly and many foreigners living here believe Kampala would be better if infrastructure is improved. If the signs were a little clearer or maybe bigger showing which road is which and what what, that might be a big help to a Mzungu, as well, maybe once in a while, a map. My view would be if they removed the border borders from town, it would be a better town. By day, Kampala is a crowded place filled with people going about their business. And when night falls, the city doesn't go to sleep with clubs, bars and entertainment venues filling up. Kampala's nightlife is fun filled, and Uganda's local brewed beer is preferred to imported beer. Nile special is perhaps my favorite. Uh, Tusker, which I know is not local, Tusker is good as well. Uh, and of course, I have had some UG. For those who don't find the disco appealing, a growing culture of live performances from Uganda's best artists can be found. <laughs> Stand-up comedy is also gaining popularity. With the growing oil and gas industry, more and more foreigners are likely to make Uganda their home. Michael Baleke, CCTV, Kampala.